गुड मॉर्निंग स्टूडेंट्स आई होप यू आर वेल इन यूर होम एंड हेल्थी टूडे वी स्टार्ट नेक्स्ट चैप्टर ऑफ फिजिक्स दैट इज फोर्स सो फर्स्ट आई एक्सप्लेन नेम ऑफ द चैप्टर दैट मीन्स वॉट इज फोर्स आई एक्सप्लेन बाय सम एग्जाम्पल फर्स्ट imagine you are going for school picnic and the bus has some trouble with its battery the driver asks the boys to push the bus what do the boys do they applied force during pushing so that the bus start when the body on the force of application moves away from us then the force so applied is called force of push second example imagine that the door of your house is jammed in rainy season your mother tries to pull it so that it opens that means she applies force to pull the door and such force is called force of pull so here we will notice that the word force is associated with either push or pull which causes some kind of motion next topic is effect of force my next topic is effect of force first point is a force can causes a motion in a stationary object when a force is applied on a stationary object it can make it move for example if we applied force on a book placed on a table it start moving when a pull the chair it start moving second a force can stop the moving object or slow them down when we applied the brake on moving bicycle it first slow down then it stops a cricketer stop the ball by applying force in the direction opposite that of the ball so here above investigation we clear that or we notice that force may stop the move, moving object or moving body or and may reduce the speed of moving object or moving body now third effect of force a force can make a moving object move faster i explain with example when a football player hit the 
moving football the ball starts moving faster second example when the horse pulling tonga applies more force that means greater force the tonga move faster next effect of force a force can change direction of moving object a cricket player hit the ball with bat that means when the cricket player hit the ball with bat his changes the speed as well as the direction of the ball second example we can change the direction of bicycle by applying forces that means by applying force on the handle next a force can change the shape of object imagine a spring fixed in a wall with nail when we pull the spring it gets stretched and here the shape changes next a force can not cause any effect on the mass of an object we know that mass is a basic property of matter when we apply the force on body it does not cause any effect on the mass of body from above example we define force force is an external agent which changes or trends to change the state of rest or uniform motion of body or changes its shape or direction now pause the video and note down all the effect of force in your class work copy now next topic is types of forces in first contact force all forces which act on body directly or through connector is called contact forces for example we can use cart by attaching rope or rigid handle of metal or wood second force at distance however there are other kind of forces which act on body from distance that means they act that uh, that means this force act through space or do not contact make with a body so here we can define force at distance that means a force which do not make direct contact with a body but act through space is called force at distance this is also called non contact force the gravitational force electrical force magnetic force are example of force at distance or non contact force consequential forces the consequential forces can be defined as a force which is called into play when a force is applied on an 
object for example when the cricket ball is made to roll on the ground by applying force it stop after covering certain distance although no force is applied to stop it it is because of force of friction is called into play as a result of rolling of cricket ball on the ground and the force of friction is always act opposite direction of the motion of body or object such type of force of friction is called constitutional force force in nature my next topic force in nature we come to across large number of forces in nature some of very important forces are described as first biological or muscular force we need we need energy for living this energy is convert into force for doing various activities this force is produced by muscles of living being is called muscular force or biological force when we push pull compress lift stretch we use our muscular force for example lifting of heavy loads or weights pulling of wheel cart pushing on lawn roller compressing of bell of cotton involves muscular force sometime we use muscular force with the help of non living thing for example x for cutting wood knife for cutting vegetable meat and fruits hammer for driving nail in wall in this per performing activities we use our muscular force 